completely opened the PS5 controller for repair and I've got the Hall Effect joystick fitted, soldered onto the main board. I'll just show it to you. Ah, these are the original potentiometer joysticks. These are very bad, which comes originally in the PS5 remote. These are having all the plastic parts like this, this green disc over here. It is all entirely made up of plastic. So these are the potentiometer original joystick potentiometers which are out of the OEM remote. Now let me show you what are the Hall Effect joysticks. I've already soldered that on the remote over here on the PCB of this controller. Let me show it to you. See guys, now these are the yellow coded Hall Effect joystick which I have soldered on the PCB of the main controller. So you have to get this one if you want to eliminate that stick drift for a lifetime from your controller. You have to solder this. So I have ordered this from Amazon and I have got a good pair of Hall Effect joysticks. So I have soldered it onto the, onto the PCB of the main controller. So really nice job done. Now let's fix the controller back. And guys these uh, Hall Effect joystick doesn't have any plastic part these are having. Uh, the magnetic movement inside this there are magnets in under, under this yellow coating over here so there are no plastic moving parts so it will be having a good long life so that is the main difference which causes strict drift so you need to get this repaired and soldered onto the main board that's the difference the controller is looking perfect see <clears throat> with the new joysticks installed now let's check on the playstation now see on the playstation also now when i'm moving the joystick see the dead zones it is working perfectly fine, see. The whole effect. It is completely smooth and working perfectly fine. Even the circular motion, it returns back to the center. On the left joystick also, perfect. So, this is a really nice upgrade for your original controller of PS5. So that's it. Do stay tuned and subscribe.